multiplication properties property 1 how many flowers will you have if you have three bunches of five flowers each three bunches of five flowers equals 3 times 5 3 into 5 equals 15 now if you make a set of three flowers in a bunch and have five bunches how many flowers will you have five bunches of three flowers equals 5 times 3 5 into 3 equals 15 therefore 3 into 5 equals 5 into 3 equals 15 in multiplication we can change the order of the numbers to be multiplied this is called commutative property of multiplication property 2 if we have more than two numbers to be multiplied then also we can multiply them in any order example 5 into 2 into 4 5 into 2 into 4 equals 5 into 2 in brackets into 4 equals 10 into 4 equals 40 or 5 into bracket 2 into 4 equals 5 into 8 equals 40 or 5 into 4 in brackets into 2 equals 20 into 2 equals 40 let us try it once more 3 into 2 into 4 3 into 2 into 4 equals in brackets 3 into 2 into 4 equals 6 into 4 equals 24 or 3 into 4 in brackets 2 into 4 equals 3 into 8 equals 24 or in brackets 3 into 4 into 2 equals 12 into 2 equals 24 This is called the associative property of multiplication. Property 3. When any number is multiplied by 0, then the product is 0. Therefore, 5 into 0 equals 0. 15 into 0 equals 0. 7 into 0 equals 0. 9 into 0 equals 0 this is zero property of multiplication property 4 if you have one bunch of five flowers how many flowers will you have one bunch of five flowers equals 1 time 5 or 1 into 5 equals 5 when one is multiplied to any number the product is always the number itself example 1 into 3 equals 3 1 into 7 equals 7 1 into 2 equals 2 1 into 9 equals 9 since multiplication is commutative 1 into 3 equals 3 into 1 equals 3 1 into 7 equals 7 into 1 equals 7 1 into 2 equals 2 into 1 equals 2 1 into 9 equals 9 into 1 equals 9